Here at Charles Campbell College, we have an open learning space for our reception students. This fosters a hands-on play-based learning environment which helps to facilitate the seamless transition from preschool to school. We encourage our students to be independent learners right from the morning where they set themselves up for the day, getting everything organised. We then invite parents to stay and read with their child for the first 15 minutes before they start their learning, which promotes a homeschool environment that fosters their learning. Students participate in literacy tutorials two times a week where they work with the teacher in a small group environment and the focus for this is on reading and comprehension strategies. It is also specifically targeted to the needs of each individual student. There are also many opportunities for older students to work alongside the reception students in a peer tutoring manner. Each week we visit the Art of 12 library where the students are able to borrow books to take home for the week as well as have the opportunity to read with some high school students which they absolutely love. We join together with the 1-2 classes for community learning once a week where they have the opportunity to work in our kitchen garden, planting produce in our garden and then using this produce that they have grown to cook foods in the kitchen which is working towards a more sustainable future. Some other ways we like to promote active and healthy lifestyles in our community learning are creating some sports activities at lunchtime which are run by the students for other students to participate in and also some of the students have created a flash mob which they performed in the playground. Our school values of learning, excellence and respect are reflected in our classroom and are the basis for our class agreement at the beginning of the year. Students decide what these values look like and how we need to behave in the classroom in order to meet each of these values. I also use a restorative justice approach to solving problems amongst students in the classroom. This is where students need to identify the harm they have caused and who has been affected by the problem and then what they need to do in order to fix things and make things right again. I feel this really empowers the reception students and they get a sense of ownership of their problems instead of always asking teachers to solve their problems. Each year we are extremely lucky to be involved in the Henny Penny Hatching Program where we get a set of eggs in an incubator in the classroom and the students get to watch the eggs hatch and grow into chickens. This is just another example of how we like to foster hands-on and play-based learning environment for our receptions.